Hello everyone, today I have a deck review for the Bohemia playing cards. You can get these cards at bmpokerworld.com by following the link in the description box. Now these decks are definitely a piece of art. During my research for these decks, I read that the art behind these decks is based on the 17th century Baroque style art as well as urban street art. So they kind of mix those together to make this deck of playing cards. It's really amazing that the artwork behind these decks was actually hand drawn and then transferred onto the decks. Looking here at the front of the box, we do see that hand drawn look to them. And it just looks very artistic and like a lot of time was put into them. And we see Bohemia written on the front of the box. And that artwork is seen all throughout the sides and back of the box. And then on the side it also says the number 52. Even the bottom of the box, which just has some manufacturing information and copyright information, even that is artistically written. The texture of this box isn't what you would expect with a normal box. It has the little dimples. It's a little bit more rough, but it's also smooth at the same time. Here are the back designs of the cards. One of them has more red and it stands out a little bit more than the other one, which is more brown and blue. They both have thin borders, which makes for really interesting fans and spreads because you can see the design when you fan the cards. Besides the different back design on these cards, the faces are identical with both the blue and the red deck. They both come with a blank card. Now the background of the card is actually like a brown or tan color. It's not, not entirely white. And then there's some lines on the side that add a little bit of design to the card. The decks also come with a Bohemia deck art card, which is just a man holding a flag that says 2012, and then there's the website down there. And these are the jokers, and you can definitely see how these were hand-painted and hand-drawn. Here is the Ace of Spades. It's quite simple. Again, we have that painted look, different shades of blues throughout it, and then there's just some Bohemia deck information there on the at the bottom. The court cards are all very customized. They do have that 17th century feel to them with that nice painted look to them and they are very interesting to look at and every single one of them is different and unique. The black number cards are made up of different shades of blue just like the Ace of Spades was and so every single one of these pips is hand painted and different and none of them are exactly identical. And the same thing goes with the red, where they have this nice red color on them. I know that the look of this deck might not appeal to everyone in the same way, because we all have different tastes. I think we can all appreciate the amount of work that was probably put into making this deck. I think that the designers of this deck did a great job putting it together, and that's why for look, I give this deck a 5 out of 5. Now for handling. These cards were printed on a bicycle stock and come with an air cushion finish, which is a stock and finish that is well known among many card handlers. These cards have very good fans with minimal clumping. They are nice and springy and they dribble well. These cards farrow evenly. Giant fans are fun to do because of the design that they result in. Here's a look at a giant fan with the red deck. Their cuts and shuffles are just what you would expect from a deck with a bicycle stock. I guess the only complaint I would have is that they do have a lot of ink on them and that might cause them to clump a little bit sooner than other decks. but. It's not to an extent that makes them unusable. So for handling, I give this deck a 4.5 out of 5. That's my review of the Bohemia playing cards. They're available at bmpokerworld.com via the link in the description box. Thank you for watching.